Your pivot table data looks like this. It takes 65 lines. Instead, it should look like this. It's way cleaner and look nicer. All you have to do is go here in the design tab and then in the report layout and then show in tabular form. And then it looks still messy, right? And then you click report layout and then repeat all item labels. And then you're gonna remove the subtotal. So your data, which had 65 lines, now look like 46 lines. You filter like this when you want a specific date range like Q1. Well, it will be smarter to do this or this. Click on your chart in the pivot table analyze tab, click on insert timeline. Then you select your date data and then you're gonna have this cute little timeline that is gonna pop. You can then select the month using shift. So click on the first month and shift on the last month. And you can also swap to quarters or even years. You go like this when you want to know your top performers. What you should do is click here, click on value filters and then click on top 10. Then you can filter by who's your top rep, top five. Then you can sort your values, click again more sort option descending by sales amount boom and then you have your top five you have a large data set and here if you click on the cog you can just sort a to z your fields here so it's easier when you have a large data set you don't have to scroll up and down and if you want to go back you sort in the data source order and you have a large data set with many fields like this then you should click on the cog here and select your layout in the pivot table fields so you can see the whole field list to your left and so it's clearer and then second tip you can sort a to z to find your fields easier i have my data set here i have different animals that, that i have my sales rep selling in different divisions so let's see what excel suggests me in the recommended pivot tables so you suggest me the sum of the price by animals so total amount by sales rep which is interesting britney spears being the top here seller sales by department or the price by department so if i just click ok and i don't have to do anything i have my pivot table right here if you just learned something make sure you hit the like button so it spreads to more people